My name is Philo Farnsworth and I invented electronic television. I think a genius is simply someone who keeps pushing, keeps exploring, keeps seeing what is possible. I think we are instruments of God put here to make something better, to improve the lives of man and that moment of creation, of inspiration, of what people call genius is God speaking through us. David Sarnoff is one of the most brilliant businessmen I've ever known. And he's one of the most hardworking people I've ever known. And in that sense, he is a genius. But his realm is not in science. And as president of RCA, they accomplished incredible amounts. They made radio what it is, and they popularized television in a huge way. But a business genius, not so much a scientist. I had the first designs for electronic television. I created them when I was uh, actually still a freshman in high school. David Sarnoff and his team of scientists disputed that claim for many, many years, partly involving a trial process, attacking our funders, things like that. There was a time during the trial and appeal process, it's not something I like to talk about, but things were particularly hard. All of our financial backers for television had pulled out in favor of RCA. My wife, Pam, and I, we didn't have much then. And the idea that television would go on and I would not be its inventor, that was hard. But ultimately, uh, my patent was recognized as the first one for electronic television, and thus, I am the inventor of television. For me, it was never about making the most money. It wasn't about running the best company. It wasn't about running the best business. All of those things would have been nice, sure. My goal was for electronic television to exist at all and to be known rightfully as its creator. So in that sense, it was a victory. All the rest was just trouble along the way.